Hi, Brian Owen with Photonic Health, one of the owners and co-founders of this company. I'd like to talk to you today a little bit about how light therapy itself works. It works on the premise of four major areas, and I'm gonna go, I'm gonna give you the list of the four areas, and then we're gonna go over each one of those individually just to talk a little more about them so you understand them. The first thing it does is called bile stimulation of cells, or where you're stimulating the cellular level of the, of the, with the lights itself in your body. The second one is it stimulates acupoints, so it just turns on acupoints from Chinese medicine. Third one is it releases muscle tissue and fascia, and the last one is viral or antiviral. So we're going to go over each one of those in depth on the next part. So biostimulation of cells. Let's talk about that a little bit. What that means is as the light is applied at a certain nanometer, which ours runs at 660 nanometers, that vibration will go into the cell through a cytochrome C oxidates down to the mitochondria of the cell. What that means, those are a lot of words, it just means it will transfer itself into the cells of the body, below the skin, all the way into tissue to bone. When that does that, it brings the vibration of that cell up to that of a healthy cell which excites the mitochondria, creating what's called ATP production. ATP production, which is adison triphosphate, will talk to the brain, send signals to the brain to send down anti-inflammatories and cause it to eliminate the pain that's happening in that area, which that will allow the body to heal. All right? So the healing of the body will happen 60 to 80 percent faster. So when we apply this to the animal, it will start the healing process. I've done this where I've taken horses that have had problems that would normally be six months and get it taken care of in three weeks. So it really does a lot. The other thing is it will work immediately on acute injuries and stop the injury from happening itself. So if you can get in there and get the vibration up, the body will trick the body into that it's not hurt and it'll start to heal. So that's what the first part does for the stimulation of cells. The second part we talked about was stimulating an acupoint. It's a pretty easy thing to do. Uh, you can do this with uh, multiple tools. Uh, you can use needles, pins, you can use hot cold pressure. But the thing is with, with the light, you can actually apply it to the acupoint. It will turn that point on in two and a half to 10 seconds. We always say 10 to 30 seconds because you know people may not be perfectly onto the light or light onto the acupoint. The acupoint will cascade outward as well as inward. So we wanna make sure you get your point. But in two and a half to 10 seconds, it will stimulate that acupoint and do all the Chinese medicine that's out there for your animal. So that's the, one of the easiest things that the light will do. Um, the thing that's different between needles or, or, and uh, pins and light is that a, a needle will cause uh, injury, which is then causing um, histamine to be there, which will continue to activate that point. We work on the premise that once every 24 to 36 hours, we redo the point, which we get better effects because you're turning the point off and on, which causes the healing to work better. So stimulating acupoints, easy thing to do. And the third area we talked about was that the light will release muscle and fascia. Um, we love it for this kind of stuff because this is what you typically do when you do a first assessment on your animal and you find out there's pain, you just put it where the pain is. That's usually a muscular pain. You can eliminate it really quick. Um, it, it, it absorbs the same way as it does when you're stimulating cells. So it goes into the muscle and releases the fascia that's inside the muscle, which just allows the muscle to lay out. A couple ways we do that is we put it on the belly of the muscle which is you just put where the point where it hurts, or you can use the insertion attachment point. You can do deep muscles, say a psoas muscle on a horse. You can put it up on the back of the lumbar area, down onto the leg, and you can release the psoas major. Can't do that with most other modalities out there, but it works really well. And then it comes the same thing as you can work with fascia points. So like our whole body balance protocol, where we use two points to release the whole front end, releasing nine muscles at a time, same thing in the back. So we're releasing fascia and trigger points. So Works wonderful for releasing muscle tissue and fascia. The fourth point we're talking about is viral, or we call it antiviral, which it's gonna eliminate the virus that's in your system. Um, 
So the first thing you kind of think about is, well, how the heck can it do that? Well, we apply it to the carotid artery of the animal, and when it does that, we try to cleanse the blood three times through the red light. When in the red light passes, when blood cells pass through the red light, it creates what's called macrophage cells. Macrophage cells is that those cells that, those white blood cells that do eat viruses in your system. So we build up the macrophage cells and it goes after the virus and typically within five to 10 minutes, you're seeing a change already. So it's a great thing to use on any time your horse or your animal feels like they're off going a different direction where they're not feeling right. We try the antiviral points and a lot of times we get them to get better. So that's what we use it for viral. So in conclusion on how light therapy works, again, there's the four major things. The biostimulation of cells, causing the wound healing 60 to 80% faster or eliminating the injury itself, stimulating acupoints, doing all the Chinese medicine, releasing muscle tissue and fascia, doing body work, that's a great thing for it, and then the antiviral, eliminating any viruses in the system. And those four things are going to be 99% of everything that's going on with you and your animal that you can take care of it, so you can take care of them. So have fun playing with this, have fun playing with it on your horse and dog and cat.